really start this video I have a little bit of explaining to do it's all about the tadpole fish uh, I've made a video about an attempt to get a tadpole fish before this one and this video is three sessions of trying for the tadpole fish on that spot uh, it was tough it was cold and it was awesome I'm on my way to the same spot that I fished in the last LRF video. Too bad there's no more in here. Almost there. I'm excited. I was so curious to know what's hiding in between the rocks. Probably gonna be sculpting in Blenny's, but who knows? Something might pop up, like a tadpole fish. Or... The, the first fish of the day was on my bait. Uh, sculpting, I don't know which one, but he let go of the hook when he was coming up. Uh, they're pretty persistent. So. I'm gonna try her for a little while longer. He is pretty persistent. He took it again. Didn't manage to hook him yet. I'm just gonna have to wait a little bit while longer. He will take it. See that? I think he's taking it. Crap party out there. Gotten them out. It's a short spined sea scorpion or a short horn sculpin. That's uh, I think the second fish of the day is nibbling on my bait. Yeah, he's on. He's on. Get off. Damn. Oh, it's a Damn. Jesus. Uh, I just got a few bites and it was a shore rock thing over 35 centimeters. It was huge. And it came off. Damn. I'm glad that I've already got this pieces. I would have been crying right now if I didn't. Damn. It was huge. So the bus will be here in a few minutes. And I should make a video about all the fish I don't get. Last time in Belgium, I failed to show you the days. Hmm. Today I failed to take out the shore rockling. I don't know what to do anymore. It's already 4.30 a.m. and I have to wake up at 7.30. Uh, came home at 2.30 I think from work and I can't sleep. I'm gonna go back tomorrow to Amiden for the tadpole fish. Which I've tried many times before now, and yesterday a guy I know went to the spot, I told him all about uh, how to get the shore rockling because 
I caught one there and I lost one there so he wanted to catch it too and I thought that fish would be a wild guess there but guess what he, he's got it I'm gonna go take the train to Utrecht and then meet up with Dirk and we are gonna go fish in Amida again. Uh, Dirk still needs a short horn sculpin, so that's an extra target for him today. Uh, and I'll just be hoping for a tadpole fish. So I'm using two rods right now. One with these, salted red one. And one with these cooked clams. And it seems like the clams are doing better than the salted rag worm today. Just found this old rig. And the ra there's still a rag worm on it and the rag worm is still alive. So it must have been from yesterday. So I've already caught more crabs in an hour than I've caught fish all year. Yay me! <laughs> 40 and 41. 43. Look at that, I just caught a longhorn sculpin and a crab at the same time. Second fish of the day, not a long horn sculpted. Release. Goodbye. The sound was a little bit bad here, but I still wanted to tell you a little bit about what I'm doing here. I've put the rods down and I've started hand lining because if I'm closer to my rod tips, I can look inside the hole and I can see what happens. And what I'm doing here is feeling the hole. Uh, I want to make sure that my sinker and my bait that is just above the sinker uh, will make it to deeper inside of the hole. So that's why I jiggle the sinker a little bit and it rolls down. And when I'm deeper, fishing deeper inside the hole I've got better chances uh, to get a fish that's hidden underneath there. Starting to get the feeling that I'm gonna have to go home again without a tadpole fish. We've been here for so what four or five hours and I've got nothing to crab. I've got 96 crab by the way. 96 and two fish and uh, another species hunter was just here and he caught two fish and went home again because he thought it was too cold but he caught a little pollock and a round goby while well, both of us got nothing so we we're still here and Dick just got his First new species of the day, short horn sculpin. I told him it should be easy, but it took us like what five to six hours? Yeah, five hours. Uh, five yeah. hours. But he's got it. So that's one thing accomplished. Uh, maybe we should film this one very clear and hope that we get a normal, uh, a short spine sculpin. Then we can compare it on the picture. Third fish for me, all the same species. I was hoping to get a little bit more today, but ah, it's still a nice fish. Gonna put him back. Oh, I got it. There it is. No. This is some sort of an achievement 
not anything you should be proud of, but this is the hundred crab of the day. As you can see, the water is rising again, just like in the last video, and I won't be able to fish here much longer. I'm gonna have to move up soon. Uh, I can still uh, fish in this hole. Uh, from the rocks on top of here But this all won't be available in I think 30 minutes Last time I was here I uh, hooked a big fish in this hole and Its head hit the surface and then the hook came out and I lost it and at first I thought it was a shore rock but Yesterday, uh, another species hunter caught it. Actually, caught a tadpole fish inside of this hole. Because I told him that there should be a shore rockling in there. And yeah, so I'm thinking more and more that I missed the tadpole fish. This is another one. Yes, regular. It's really different. Different colors. Oh yeah, it doesn't have the red. Not nice. <laughs> so today is gonna be my fifth attempt to get a tadpole fish and that's only this winter I've fished it way more times it's freezing which should be good for the tadpole fish uh, it's gonna be low water when it's getting dark so I'll be fishing at low tide when it's dark which should be perfect and uh, the other times it was uh, low tide uh, at two or three and uh, when it's low tide I can reach the good holes in the rocks and when the water gets higher I cannot and last time it was already uh, high tide before it went dark last two times actually and the time before that I think I had a fucking tadpole fish on but it spit the hook when I was lifting it up, so... Uh, and that was when it was getting dark. So, let's hope that by replicating uh, that situation today, it'll take again and I won't replicate him spitting the hook. Got my rag ones. And adrenaline is pumping. I've never been so excited before a fishing session. Right now. I'm actually praying to the fishing gods right now. Poseidon, please just give me a tadpole fish. Miss Grant, please just leave me alone. Maybe you're wondering what this weird stick is well I've watched a movie on YouTube a video about a thing called poke pole and they just use a piece of wood or metal like this attached a very strong line to it a fairly big hook I'm using jig head and you can reach some holes better with this than with a fishing rod so of course I'm gonna try both. I'm not gonna leave the rods at home. You see that flag? That flag is telling me that I'll have the wind right in my face. 
on my fishing spot. It's a bit unlucky with that, but I'm still feeling confident. I'm gonna get me a tadpole fish today. Well, of course, I don't know for sure, but this should be the perfect timing. Perfect weather conditions. Perfect tide. Perfect time of the day. Perfect fresh bait. Perfect new rod. Alright, poke polling is working. Two minutes in. Uh, big ass long horn sculpin. Nice. Jeez, that's it, that's it. That's it, man. That's it. I got it. Yes. Clean, too. Look, he doesn't have that, as many scars as the one Mosa got. So, and I think mine is bigger as well. I was gonna go to Norway for this species. I'm still going to Norway, but this would have been the main target, but I got a dodge stamp all over here. And now I'm gonna put it back. Goodbye, Mr. Tapper. You feeling that energy? Come on, come on. Yeah, he's regaining strength now. Just needs a little breather here. Are you gonna go? You gonna go? Yeah, you're gonna go. He's a bit shocked from my photo session. But I think he'll be okay. He's getting to the bottom. And I got it now. My life is complete. I'm gonna quit fishing and start a new career in... I don't know, maybe I'll play checkers. So I've not even fished for an hour. And the sun is not even all the way down yet. But I already got my tadpole fish. And as expected, it's fucking cold out here. So, I'm gonna go. I'm just gonna go home, relax. Grab a beer. Final view of our golden LRF spot. I uh, probably won't be back here for a while. Uh, the tadpole fish was really the last target <laughs> that I wanted to get here.
Number 152 for my list.